And in further escalation of the rift between the Indian government and Twitter, the centre has told Delhi High Court the social media giant has failed to comply with India's new IT rules. The government emphasised that the IT rules constitute the law of the land and is mandatorily required to be complied with. The centre, in an affidavit filed in the High Court, said that any non-compliance amounts to breach of provisions of IT rules, leading to Twitter now losing its immunity, confirmed confirmed under the IT Act. In the affidavit, the government said that Twitter had failed to comply as it has not appointed the chief compliance officer, a resident gr grievance officer or a nodal contact person. It said that Twitter India has also not shown uh, any physical contact address on its website. Now, Twitter had earlier informed Delhi court that the company was in the final stages of appointing a resident grievance officer after the interim resident grievance officer withdrew his candidature last month. Recently, Twitter has had some foul run-ins with the Indian government. In the last seven days, several police complaints have also been filed against the microblogging portal for serious charges. These include two over an incorrect map of India where Jammu and Kashmir were shown as a separate nation and one for allowing access to child pornography. Earlier this month, a case was also filed against Twitter in connection with tweets on the alleged assault on a Muslim man. India's Information and Technology Minister Ravi Shankar Prasad's account was also blocked for over an hour. Twitter had denied him access on the grounds that there was a violation of Digital Millennium Copyright Act of the United States. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.